Thanks, Heather. Well, over the past few days now, we've been looking for mutts that are in need of a makeover, and I can't tell you how many applications have uh, come in. Apparently, a lot of people out there think their dog could use some uh, grooming, <laughs> perhaps. We have Andrew and Tara here. Thank you guys for coming down. And who did you bring with you, Andrew? Uh, this is Allie, our little puppy. And what can you tell us about Allie? Apart uh, from the fact that she's absolutely adorable, <laughs> I have to say, we've all been uh, eyeing her up. <laughs> what kind of dog is she? Uh, she's a half Bichon Frise, half Shih Tzu. Okay. And she's about one year and one month old. Excellent. So just a, a young pup yet. Uh, Tara, you got her as a puppy, is that the idea? We did, yeah. yeah. Our neighbor had a similar dog from the same breeder, so okay. we drove to Saskatchewan to pick her up. A girl from the prairies, after my own heart, I gotta <laughs> say. So uh, you, you've had her from just newborn, is that the yeah. That it? Yeah, since she's like two months old. And does she get all sorts of special treatment? Is she, you know, a member of the family now? Pretty much, yeah. We, yeah. we have one other dog too, so. Okay. She, she bugs him a lot. <laughs> What's your other dog? Uh, he's a Cocker Spaniel Poodle. Okay. He's four years old. But you just thought Allie was the one that was, was in need of the makeover, is that it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, she's, she's a little, she rolls in the mud and okay. she's got a little bit longer hair, so she really, really needs it. Oh, okay, there we have the picture. Obviously, yeah. that was right after one of her mud baths. That was actually on her birthday. <laughs> I took her to the dog park and she literally rolled in a mud puddle. Oh my god. The only goodness. mud puddle there she found it. <laughs> they always do. Yeah. You know, we were we were talking off camera too that it's as soon as you try to get them out of there, you see them there, <laughs> you're calling them and, and that's when they decide to, to dive right in. Um, a special diet for her or anything or um. <laughs> uh, she loves to eat peanut butter. <laughs> yeah, favorite foods, okay. So, yeah. Lots of little treats. Sometimes she'll eat dirt too, so <laughs> <laughs> of course. Yeah. Now uh, what would you like to see done in terms of a makeover? What are you, what are you hoping for? Well, her hair is very long and mm -hmm. grows so fast. We'd love to get her a haircut um, and to make it to uh, wash her a little bit easier after she's finished rolling around in the mud. Yeah, because <laughs> you know that's not going to stop, right? Yeah. <laughs> no. It's be, be much easier. Does, uh, does she do any tricks? Um, I, I won't make you do it right now. No. I know dogs never like to perform on she, camera. She does know how to roll over, but... Uh, for some reason, she won't do it on cement. She does it in our living room. Oh, really? Yeah. She likes to have carpet. Very particular. Yeah, she's still learning. <laughs> she, uh, she also, when she, whenever she sees dogs on TV, she barks and runs up to the TV and gets just, excited. Just jumps on the TV. Uh, we, we were watching yesterday with the police dogs, and she was going crazy. So. Well, yeah. I mean, she knows what she likes, I guess. Well, put her down in front of the TV because uh, for for today and tomorrow, we're going to be showcasing some more. Ugly mutts, if you will, although she's too pretty to be called ugly right now. But of course, you can check out our website too, citytv.com, and, and starting tomorrow, you'll be able to vote on some of your favorite pooches that you see there and, and decide which one really is in need of a makeover. So, Andrew, Tara, thank you so much for bringing Allie down. It's time for us to be taking a break. We'll be back with more BT. Breakfast television is brought to